Hello everyone. It is story time with Auntie D. Let's start today's book. Today's book is Bear and Friends, A House for Mouse. This book is going to be so much fun because as we read the book on each page, we are actually going to solve a puzzle. There is going to be a letter that's going to be hidden somewhere on the page. And then we are going to try to find it. Isn't it fun? So let's go ahead and first go through all the pages of this book. Okay, let's start. So let's see what this book is all about. We see a bear, we see a mouse, we see a squirrel. And I think they're looking for a house for the mouse, right? Let's see, looks like they are going on, hunting for a home. He is holding a map, he's trying to go look for it. She is holding a book with different, different homes. When we read the story is when we'll find out what all is going on. Look at them, they're such good friends, they're helping him find a home. Looks like they are going inside the forest inside different different homes to see how they are they are also climbing up the homes ha huh? look at that this house seems to have a big staircase to go up right oh they also have the can you see that let's see which one actually mouse chooses the home to be oh they are looking up oh they are looking down too and squirrel is somewhere else. So many homes to choose from, huh? Wow! They go and see some more homes. That's what you have to do, right? You have to go and find the home that you like. You have to go and look and look and look and finally see what is it that you like. This is going to be a fun story, I think, to read. Let's start, guys. Now that we have seen the book, I know some of you have already found the letter, huh? Let's start reading the story. This is Bear. There are, these are Bear's friends. This is Mouse. And this is Squirrel. Help Mouse find a house. Then find the letter M hidden in each picture of their story. What do you think? Are we ready to find the letter M? Mouse wants a house. We can help. So all friends are going to help Mouse find a house. Can you guys see the letter M? Let's see if we can find it anywhere on the page. Anywhere on the page. There you go. It's on the tree stem letter M. Is this a good house? Look at that. But that is really big. And mouse is quite small, huh? Now, let's keep on looking for the letter on this page. Let's see if we can again find it. Do you see M anywhere? I see one here. I actually can see one more M. Can we try to look for it? Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. This is letter H. M, 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 M. M. Do you see that? I found one more. Let's go on to the next page. Now, see, the bear looks cozy in the house, but the house is too big for this tiny little mouse, isn't it? Now, let's start with a puzzle. Hmm, I can't seem to find the M. Can you spot it? Let's see, let's see. Do you see M anywhere, anywhere, anywhere? Whose picture is that? Oh, look in the photo frame. There is the letter M. 
Is this a good house? Squirrel is asking. It is up. See, because the house that Squirrel found was all the way up. That means Mouse will have to keep on climbing it up and down. Right? Like how squirrels do it all the time. Now let's do our puzzle. Oops, I already see one. Big one. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, this is a nice picture, isn't it? I like it. Look at all the stairs all the way going up. This one was very quick to find, isn't it? See, Mouse is saying the same thing. It is way up. It's hard for him to find, go up, right? And see, look at that. It's all the way at the edge. I don't think he's very happy. Isn't it so easy to spot here? It is right there. We look up, Squirrel is saying. Look up. What are all these? They're honeybees. We look down. They're also trying to see if there is a good house down somewhere for him. Is this a good house? See, Squirrel is again looking. See, it is made with all the wooden. Oh, did I just spot the letter? And I see one more M. Can you see if you can spot that? Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. There is one more M right there. So they are trying to look at all these homes. This is two up. This is two down. What about this one? They are all going on looking at different homes for the mouse, right? We look here. Whose house is that? That is the snake's home. Can you see the snake? So he lifts the big rock and then what does he see the snake? Would you like a home like that? Mouse is not sure yet. We look there. See, he's looking at that other home made from the wood. Is this a good house? See, he's looking at another playhouse. Squirrel is asking. How many M's are on these pages, guys? Can you spot them? There is one over the snake's home. Look at that. Then there is one more over the wooden home, which is right here. And do we have anything on the third home? I think there is one. Can you guys see? Can you guys see? Right there, there is letter M. So many M's, huh? So they are so trying to find the house. Mouse doesn't seem like a happy one yet. Doesn't look like he has found his home yet, right? We did not help. Bear feels like there is a house for mouse. Because they are trying to look from their point of view, right? Because bear wants a big home. Squirrel wants a house up there. But Mouse is not happy with any of those homes. Let's see if we can find our letter here. Hmm. I'm having a hard time finding one. Can you guys see? Maybe at the bottom of the page somewhere. Can you guys spot it? Oops. There is one right here on the log. So is there one on the log there? There is no one on the log. But I see one on the rock here is a house now mouse looks at one see it is not too big it is not way up and it has a for sale sign so what is it it's inside a tree trunk mice usually are all around that right so they are trying to decide, is this a good house for mouse yet? And there is already such a big, big M right in the center. Is this a good house? The bear is asking. Mouse is going in to see. 
Ooh, and what do they see? This is a good house for mouse. Why? Because everything is of his own size. See, there is a tiny little table, tiny little chair where mouse can sit and have his cup of tea or a cup of coffee, whatever that he likes. I think this is a very, very cute house. What do you guys think? And we already spotted the M last time, remember? Where was that? That was on the tree trunk. And he seemed to like it, isn't it? Mouse found a house. Looks like he did like that house. But something else was hiding. Did you find the letter M's hidden in each picture of the story? We did, didn't we? So, what is this? This is a mouse. What is this? This is a map. And what is this? This is a mug. It was a good storybook, right? There was a puzzle also, but at the same time, it also had a story. This book was written by Jody Jensen Schaffer. And all these beautiful pictures were drawn by Claire Rossiter. And this book was published by Highlights Press. I like this book. Did you guys like it? Mouse finally found the home that he was looking for. Not too big, not too small, not up there, not down there, but just where he wanted. A good story, right? See you guys next time. Bye-bye.